Hey guys, Freelio here with a Minecraft video. Um, this video is part of my hard Let's Play series, but it's not, well, it's not the same server we're on. Right now we are on a multiplayer server, the Clan Dragons of Abyss multiplayer server, or guild, or clan, or whatever you want to call it. Um, right now I'm in the spawn point. Uh, I remember showing you this in another one of my videos, but I wanted to go a little bit further for a few minutes here and kind of give you a tour. So I'm going to head right here east. I have a, a post on here just to show everybody when you go out the gate which direction you're going. And we will come up here. <coughs> Some sheer cliffs on either side of this stairway. Um... I've actually considered two areas to be uh, a distinct locations now. This is one of them. <coughs> this is the forest colonies here. As you can see. I guess I don't need this on here. Forest colonies. Here stands the great forest colonies. The banner hanging off of a post there, and the letters just randomly floating. Um, I'm not going to take you through a 100 complete full tour or 100% complete full tour. See, I have fairly sleepy cabin here in the forest colonies. Just a nice, easy little thing. Nothing in the chest. Sorry. And as we continue on. Um, <clears throat> there's a lot of places to build. I mean, we hope to get a lot of people building here. This is our shorter route to this side. Um, we stopped the road here. Uh, it can go on if we need it to. Or you can build at the end of the road and we can go a different direction or around a house or whatever. But I thought I'd just go ahead and put a little cabin in there. <clears throat> it was a nice small little area. Of course, the areas around here. And then this is our longer path, this direction. And by longer, I mean really long. So I'll take you through here. Um, just relax and enjoy the ride. Are those all wolves? Look at all the wolves. Incredible. Right, we have a little bridge here with a cave underneath it. So along the roads, there's a ton of caves, guys. <coughs> that was kind of part of the plan, plus we didn't want to fill in the caves or explore them ourselves. That's for everyone else. Um, <coughs> Rybarian and I both have our own location, um, our own private area. Which, uh, <clears throat> I'll go ahead and show you, but I'm not exactly going to tell you how to get there. And then this path just kind of goes off to the side. Just an extra little area. But then it keeps going, and as you see, we use mossy cobblestone for the effect for the, the tunnels. Just because it kind of blends in and goes with the surroundings, you know. We continue on. Plenty, plenty of places to build. We just decided to make this road as straight as can be, and as far as we really could handle doing it. There's another really big cave down in there. I don't know if there's any monster spawners anywhere. We don't have monsters turned on right now, so I, I have no idea. And it just keeps going on. There's a nice little area in there. And finally, it turns... And we come to another another location, so almost there. We keep on coming this way, and it goes down. <coughs> Some stairs here. Over to here, over to the, the shore here. Um, there could be a lot to be built there. 
Alright, I'm going to run all the way back to the spawn point, um, and I will show you another island, which is the GM island, the Game Master island for Barbarian and myself. Uh, we just started development on it and flattening it and making it look nice and neat, but we haven't built anything on it. And actually, we probably won't. So anyway, I'll head back over there, and uh, I'll see you when I get there. Just thought I'd take the rest of this pretty walk with you guys. Um, there's a spawn point over there, and sorry if I have lag from time to time, I'm just trying to get a high definition video uploaded this time. See if that's at all possible. Alright, and then over here, we don't have anything, this is the southern gate. And then the northern, the northern gate doesn't have anything either. So here's the western gate. We have some docks right here. I'll come back to that in just a moment. Nicely manicured land right there as well. We have kind of a canal over there. Uh, I kind of refer to it as spawn canal. Anyway, and right here it doesn't go too awful much further. It just kind of forks off into crossroads here. And it stops there. That stops up there. And this one stops up here. And this is also part of the forest colonies on the other side of spawn. Of, yeah, of spawn. I'll call it spawn. Uh, kind of like a territory name. Um, I've drawn it, drawn it out on a map. I'll have to explore a little bit just to make it a bigger area. Anyway, so now I want to take you on a boat over to another area. Um, or as a matter of fact, I won't. I'll just, I'll make my way over there off screen here, and uh, I'll show you the, uh, the GM island, so I'll be right back. Well, while I'm showing you things, I don't want to forget to show you my, uh, my little private hangout, my bedroom, my key room, which opens the door to this here, which is my safe room. Um... my workshop, danger, lava, lava down on in there, and then my private pool. Alright, now I will head over to GM Island. Alright, so here's our island. We want to make the rest of these islands just right around here, kind of GM Islands, and I already kind of consider them to be GM Islands, and then off to the distance over there somewhere maybe over there, or maybe back there. I don't know, there's a deserty area, and I kind of call that the GM Desert. We kind of just own this area. It's our own little private building area. Um, okay, now I'm going to show you something else. I'll be right back. All right, we are in my igloo, which is basically the capital and the main building here, at least for now, for the Frost Colonies. We have our little power building there. Let me show you upstairs. This is all made out of snow, so it's very... Well, it can melt very easily, and you can break it very easily, so please don't. Here's my little room here. As you can see, off to the distance, the Frost Colony flag and letters. As well as a watchtower. And I will take you over there in just a moment. Let's head out the other door. Although, let's head out this door right here. And I have a little balcony. With lots of glass here. Let me just head around. It's kind of a modern igloo, isn't it? I mean, I've got a lot of different glass viewpoints here. Now, here's the little power room. You got all the moving, rushing water and, you know, that kind of stuff. <laughs> Alright, now let's take the subway on over, shall we? All powered rails just to make sure either way you're going, you're not going to have any problems. And here we are. On top of the world. And as you can see down there, there's the beautiful frost colonies um, and our igloo. 
Sorry, I'm not exactly perfect at making, you know, spheres or half spheres or anything. It's just what I made. Um, and then right down there, right in front of us to the bottom, is uh, the flag. Um, and here's the tower. Let's go up the tower. Nice glass all around it. Wooden stairs. And it looks like it's snowed, and once we reach the top, we kind of have a lookout tower. Above cloud level, right over there that I'm looking at, that frozen lake there, that's Frost Lake. Not, yeah, yeah Frost Lake, since these are the Frost Colonies. It's one of the main and largest frozen lakes. And, uh, yeah, so there you go. We have uh, three distinct areas on our map, as you can see over there, there's a big ocean, uh, a lot of stuff going on. So anyway, if anybody is interested in playing on this server, all you have to do is leave a comment with your Minecraft username so I can add you to the whitelist and I'll toss you the IP address so you can pop on. Um, and you are free to build anywhere you wish to build. If you don't want to build on the beaten path, you don't have to. You can go far off the beaten path and build whatever you want, wherever you want. You do need to get your own materials, though. However, if you're willing to help me actually form this this world, um, I, uh, I'll, I'll allow you to basically spawn some items for yourself. But that's only for forming the base part of the world here and making it a lot more interesting. Um, I mean, I obviously could have gotten enough snowballs for what I built down there and this tower, but... I mean, that's that would take so much time, and I didn't bother. I just spawned everything you see. I spawned just about all of it. So, uh, all right, guys, thanks for watching. I know this wasn't part of our true Let's Play, but, I mean, it, it does the trick. It's our server for anybody who watches my videos, for example. You're welcome to, to join up on. Uh, let me show you the ride back. Going way downhill with this one. And then our straightaway. So there you have it, folks. Um, remember, leave your uh, Minecraft username if you want to uh, mess around on here. It's still new, and I'm new to managing a server and everything, and it has some plugins to it on craft bucket but uh only like three so all right guys uh, i will see you in another episode